said to one of the girls, um, I think there's someone famous on the plane. <laughs> and I didn't know it was us. I didn't know. And it, well, none of us. None of us. None none of the, the nicest thing I remember are just the genuine people, mm. you know, and like they used to try and stop our bus getting somewhere and then hand little gifts through the windows to us. I think because we were so young, we weren't so aware of that massive crowd, although it was loud and it was hot. And, huge and a massive environment, we probably hadn't understood the magnitude of that game. We played for a little while and then we found out that we got banned because we'd been. And the younger ones got banned for three months, um, the older for six months and Harry Bat had a lifetime ban. I know that the people that made this possible were Harry Bat and his wife June. Um, they like organised it all, they took you there. It wouldn't have been possible without them. No. Um, what would you like to say to Harry now if you could? Don't make me cry. It is actually very emotional about Harry. He promoted women's football, he had great belief. You know, he, he said that one day there will be a female Arsenal, and, and newspapers scoffed at that. And we have product next to me, Jill, who was part of the founding Arsenal team. It's important he has a place in history. Yeah. Yeah. This will give him a platform, a legacy that he deserves because, my goodness, if ever anyone had had 